Hi guys, it's me Danielle again. I'm sorry I haven't been filming, but I've been very, very busy doing something else. Um, today I'm going to show you a bronze um, makeup trend for the summer. Um, let me just take off my lipstick. Okay. Let me get my mirror. Um, as you can see, guys, if you can see, I know my my window and the sun is like all over the place. But um, I'm gonna show you a little bronze uh, uh, look today. Um, I just got my eyebrows done, as you can tell. Um, the hair looks so hot. I love them. But let's get on to the makeup. Um, I already put on foundation and bronzer as you can see. And um, I'm just going to do my eyes for today. So let's get started. Okay. Um, what you want to do, I put up on a moisturizer already. And my foundation, I use a different kind of foundation. Um, the three in one CoverGirl Hourglass Stay Fabulous Foundation. And concealer, I put Mac Roll Long Wear Concealer. This is really good, seriously. Um, and for primer underneath that, I put a uh, Laura Craft I'm So Sensitive Teaser Face Bronzer. And I just put on highlight and all of that. I've already primed my eyes with primer by MAC Cosmetics. Now, and I already powdered my face. Um, sorry guys, I'm here. I just need my water. I'm going to curl my eyelashes. Don't curl your eyelashes after you put on mascara because uh, that that can damage and break your eyelashes. Okay. I'm all over the place today. I, your blending brush, I'm going to take MAC Soft Brown and put it all on the crease. Actually, I forgot one step. Oops. I'm sorry guys. I'm taking my MAC Full Palette and see this the Prunella color? I usually put it all on my lid before I put it on. So that was a mistake I did, but you don't have to put on the the white all over your eye. You could just go on to your makeup. I, I like I like doing that. So put that all over your eyes. If you do, make sure you buff it out because you don't want to want any harsh white lines on your lid. Okay. Now we close that. Yes. And now we take the mask. Um soft brown to put it in the crease. It's up to you whether you sorry guys. I have something in my eye and I'm trying to get it out. 
Let's see. Okay. There you go. Now I'm going to take Matt's book around and put it in the crease. You can, uh, you can do the opposite way. It doesn't matter, but I like doing it that way. Put it in the crease. Make sure you blend, 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 because when you blend, your makeup com comes out so good. And blend until your hands fall off and your eyes hurt. That's how I blend in Make sure you get a tiny little crease over here. That's where everybody tends to forget. Sorry guys, I do make up with my mouth open. You guys want you can lift up your eye if that's better for you and do it in the crease. And sometimes I don't look in the mirror because I'm used to it already. I know I know my eye shape. Now I'm gonna take Maybelline palette, and I'm gonna take ooh, it broke on me. <laughs> it's okay. I have to put it back. It breaks again. Now I don't know. There you go. Now I'm gonna take this gold color and put it on my eyes. Now I just Eyeshadow brush by Mac. Open your eyelid and just put it all over over your eye. I do the other eye. There you go, see? Now if you want to come on, If you want to pack on your eyeshadow, don't worry, you can. It doesn't make a difference if you do or not. Okay. Oh, my, my palette broke again. Don't you just hate when that happens? <laughs> now I'm going to go in with my matte palette again. Ow! Ow, ow, that hurt. And I'm going to take this brown color here. And put, put it on my eyes. Eye. Just the corner. Uh, I mean... Not the corner, the uh, middle of your eye, because you 
you won't want the eyes to pop. Just a little bit. See that? Now I'm going to take the blending brush and just blend away. And if you want to add another color, like I am right now, you can. I'm going to take Texture by MAC, and I'm going to put it in the crease. Just to get his your eyes some depth. It's a little bit darker and smokier. Now we're going to put on. Um, I hurt my finger. Anyway, <laughs> now I'm going to put on um, black track. You can e either put, put on gel eyeliner or liquid eyeliner, it does not matter. First, or you could put a black pencil on your eye, then followed by the liquid or gel eyeliner. It does not, it, it, it does not matter. I prefer to put on the gel eyeliner first. sometimes have a hard time putting on your eyeliner. I don't know why. There you go. See, actually, I take a um, long time doing eyeliner. I do not know why. bear with me. There you go. Now I'm going to put on Black Track by MAC over that.
should follow. Sorry guys. Can you see? It is follow the um the line that had you originally made with the gel eyeliner or liquid. There you go. I don't know if you can see, but mm, my room is just about to think of filming. Sorry guys. But you can get a good idea on how it looks. <laughs> I'll, I'll give you that much. I'll give you that much. Okay. Now, we're going to... I have MAC Prep and Prime put on before I put on mascara because it tends to um, make your, your eyelash really long. And we have a few fallouts on the skin, so don't worry. You you should just you should just um fix that. So we just fix that. and just go over the foil. Now I'm taking um, Peter Tong Lacoste uh, Mascara. I love this mascara. It, oh my god, your eyelashes grow like 10 times with this mascara. I love it. Some mascara on top and the bottom.
know, if you want to curl your eyelashes, don't use your eyelash curl because that could break your eyelashes. Take these two fingers and just wipe it to dry and just go like this. Up. It will make your hands dirty, but you know what? You can just. I'm not going to do my eyebrows today because I just uh, got them done because I don't want to ruin them, sorry. And I don't put on false eyelashes because I'm allergic, not to the false eyelashes itself, I'm allergic to the glue. There's something in the glue that makes my eyes watery and teared. So I don't put them on myself. So I'm sorry about that guys. But, this black eyeliner, now I'm going to tie down the little gloves. Sometimes you can poke yourself in the eye like I did. Sometimes it just takes practice. It just takes practice. Now I'm going to put it in my waterline. Unfortunately, I'm not using waterproof, so um, now I'm going to take my white vanilla and just highlight. Um, sorry guys, I have allergies as you all know. I'm going to highlight. Now I'm going to take MAC Peaches and just This lipstick doesn't come off, it stays on, but I'm going to go to put on Maybelline, no, uh, Milani, Brilliant Shine Lip Gloss. And I gotta tell you something, this tastes like chocolate. Obviously, I don't need it, but when you lick your lips, it, it, it does taste like chocolate. There you go, a um, blonde tutorial look. How do you like it? <laughs> okay, um, I'll come up with more, uh, um, I'll come film more makeup tutorials, and I'll see you guys soon. Okay, take care. Oh, um, comment me down on the bottom if you want, and um, 
subscribe to my video, please, because I love all my comments, if I get any. <laughs> That's on you if you subscribe to my videos or not to see future videos. Um, my uh, website is called D uh, Dazzle Me Up Makeup on Facebook. Go there, please like my page and um, and I guess I'll see you guys soon with more films. <laughs> Alright, bye.